Have you ever wondered how breeders create those breathtakingly patterned budgies with striking colors? Well, today we're diving into the fascinating world of opaline mutation budgies, one of the most stunning and sought-after mutations in the budgie world. But what happens when you crossbreed them? What unique combinations can emerge? Stick around, because we're about to unravel the genetic secrets of the opaline mutation. And trust me, you'll be amazed at the results. Stay tuned till the end, because we'll be revealing some incredible incredible crossbreeding outcomes you won't want to miss. Let's get started. Opaline mutation budgies explained. So what exactly is the opaline mutation? Well, it's not just about color, it's about pattern. This mutation alters the traditional budgie feather arrangement, redistributing melanin in a way that creates a softer, more blended effect. The result? A budgie with a washed out back, a more defined wing pattern, and an overall smoother color. Transition. You can spot an opaline by its lighter back and the way its markings seem almost hand painted. But wait, this isn't just about looks. The opaline mutation is sex linked, meaning it follows a unique inheritance pattern when bred. And that's where things get really interesting. Now that we know what makes opalines special, let's explore their defining traits. Characteristics of opaline mutation budgies. Beyond their breathtaking appearance, opaline budgies have some key characteristics that set them apart. Their wing markings appear softer, their backs lack the typical barring seen in wild-type budgies, and their colors often seem richer and more evenly spread. Opalines come in a variety of shades, blue, green, violet, and even lutino opalines, that glow like little suns. The mutation enhances other colors, making them more vibrant and giving breeders an exciting palette to work with. Speaking of breeders, how exactly do you breed an opaline budgie? Let's break it down. Breeding of opaline mutation budgies. Breeding opaline budgies isn't just about pairing two pretty birds together. Because this is a sex-linked mutation, genetics play a crucial role. If a male budgie carries the opaline gene, he can pass it on to his daughters, while a female opaline must have an opaline father. Here's a quick genetics breakdown. If you breed an opaline male with a normal female, all the daughters will be opaline, but the sons will just be carriers. However, if you breed an opaline female with a normal male, none of the chicks will be opaline, but the male offspring can carry the gene for future generations. Now let's get to the most exciting part. What happens when we crossbreed opalines with other mutations? Crossbreeding outcomes of opaline mutation budgies. Here's where the real magic happens. Crossbreeding opaline budgies with other mutations can result in some truly spectacular birds. Let's look at a few examples. Pairing an opaline male with an opaline female results in 100% opaline chicks. A pairing of opaline male with a normal budgie gives 50%. Normal split opaline male chicks and 50% opaline female chicks. If you pair a normal split opaline male with an opaline female, the result is 25%. Normal split opaline male chicks, 25% opaline male chicks, 25% opaline female chicks, and 25% normal female chicks. If you pair a normal male with an opaline female, the result is 50% normal split opaline male chicks, 50% normal female chicks. When you pair a normal split opaline male with a normal female, the result is 25% normal split opaline male chicks, 25% normal male chicks, 25% opaline female chicks, and 25% normal female chicks. Sometimes crossbreeding can lead to surprises, unexpected, color intensities, new pattern variations, or even rare phenotype combinations that become highly sought after by collectors and breeders alike. So, what have we learned about opaline mutation budgies? Let's wrap it up. From their mesmerizing patterns to their exciting genetic potential, opaline mutation budgies are a treasure trove for breeders and bird enthusiasts. Whether you're simply admiring their beauty or planning your next breeding project, these birds prove that nature always finds a way to amaze us. So tell us, what's your favorite opaline crossbreed? Or maybe you have an opaline budgie of your own. Share your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more incredible budgie content. Until next time, keep your flock happy and your passion for birds soaring.